Back here with the four minute drill, Ramondre Stevenson, our third guest. Uh, I don't know if that offends you, if you're honored to be here following Hunter Henry, following Pop Douglas, I just gave you the rundown. It's four minutes straight. Football questions alternated with non-football questions. I'm gonna start the clock and then we're gonna go, all right? Yes, sir. Oh, and the only rule is everyone knows, unlike a real four minute drill, you cannot run out the clock. So we gotta go a rapid fire, we're we're gonna talk real. All right, ready, set. First one, today essentially marks the end of training camp. Next week is a regular season style prep week. Mm -hmm. If I give you a little bit of truth serum, how happy are you that you're done with camp? Uh, very happy. You know, it's an accomplishment to, you know, get through camp and it's a, you know, it's a long grind. So to be done with it, you know, it feels good. All right. Very good. So you told me a story, I think last season, maybe two years ago about working at a Walmart once we were talking about odd jobs Mm -hmm. and there was this giant milk pallet that spilled everywhere in the Walmart. You told me you had some sort of milk phobia. Can you update us on the milk phobia? Can you not smell it? Do you not want to see it? Obviously you don't want to drink it. Right. I haven't, I haven't even drank milk in so long. (laughs) <laughs> and it, probably a couple of years. I don't eat cereal too much, anything like that. So after that, that uh, pallet of milk fell, it was a wrap. Because it was a smell, right? Just yeah, it was just guess. over with. All right, glad to be at a Walmart back in some town <laughs> Las Vegas. Uh, let's go back to the field. The hardest hit you've taken in a game. I need the who, the ah. when, and how to happen. I think they brought his clout. He used to play here. Uh a Landon Roberts. Ooh, yes, dark grind. Yeah, it was actually, he hit me twice. I ain't gonna lie. My two hardest hits I took from a Landon. So, uh, in the, my first game, he hit me. You know, we played him twice a year. The second yep. game, he hit so me. So, Miami 21, right? Uh-huh. The season opener. Yep, exactly. Okay. Yep. Don't go look at the receipts either. <laughs> Just believe me. Uh, did you see him in Pittsburgh at all? Uh, did he hit you at all when he was with them? Nah, nah. All right, that's two football questions in a row. We're already breaking the rules here in the four minute <laughs> drill. Um, Mayo has talked to us about this new players lounge. You got an Xbox in there. There's a PS5. Mm-hmm. There's pool. Give us a moment in there. Take us inside. I don't know if you're playing, but somebody else. Just take us inside the lounge. Oh uh, yeah, just what yesterday. Uh, me and Kevin Harris. Uh, last week, I ain't gonna lie. He beat me. South Carolina against Oklahoma. I was Oklahoma, of course. He's South yep. Carolina. But yesterday, I got him back. Uh, beat him with some plays we run in practice. So it was, it was kind of fun. Okay, playing some NCAA. I still need to get that, but I also. Oh, like yeah. my free time because I feel like I would just oh, get yeah, home yeah. and get sucked into it. All right. <laughs> um, all right. Two players in the locker room. One who would make the best roommate and someone who you would guess would make the worst roommate. Best roommate, I would say, I will say KB. Okay. He'll just get you ready in the morning, bring that energy and get you ready for your day, I feel like. And you said the worst? Yeah. The worst roommate? Uh, I don't know if you're a neat guy, you don't mind a little slob or uh, they're up late. But let what? me think. Uh, we got 90 seconds. I'm running the, the running the clock out. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna get delay game. <laughs> worst worst room. <laughs> I'll say uh, Pop Douglas, bro. He played too much. Okay. Like, he's just too playful. He gonna be trying to, you know, talk mess all day. I'm not with that. I'm just trying to chill. Pop. He's off the wall. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Uh, next question. Going off the field now. How does Ramondre Stevenson deliver the bad news? Of breaking up with someone, are you are you a good breaker upper? Uh, I'm not. I'll just ghost you to be honest. Really? Yeah. Man, that's disrespect. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's look ahead. Week one, you're playing Cincy. You haven't seen these guys in a while since 22. Mm-hmm. Just give me one thought, an actual real thought, not can like podium answer about facing the Bengals. Uh, I know they have a great defense. Uh, just how they fly around. It's not even the people. Not even like the individual, just their defense as a whole. You know, they play they play really nice together and they fly around. So hopefully we could uh, match that on offense. Would you play tomorrow if you could? Like if oh, they just, of course, yeah. My play. body feel ready and I'm ready. All right, last one. We got 20 seconds left. Uh, this is a staple on the four minute drill. What's your least favorite media question? Least favorite media question. Uh, when y'all ask me about the quarterbacks. Because <laughs> <laughs> you don't know what to say. Yeah, you don't want to get in trouble. Like, yeah, exactly. I don't know what to say. Like, I'm out there with him, but, like, I'm not a quarterback. Right. I just know when he hands me off the ball, it's a good handle. Cool. All right, well, I'm going to hand it back to Jackson, our producer here. That's four minutes with Reminder Stevenson. Appreciate you, bro. Yes, sir. Thank you.